How to improve your communication skills. Verbal and written tips for success. In order to be successful in any field, strong communication skills are essential. Whether you're communicating verbally or in writing, being able to effectively communicate your thoughts and ideas is crucial. In this blog post, we'll explore some tips on how to improve your communication skills. We'll cover the importance of both verbal and written communication, as well as some specific tips on how to improve your abilities in each area. By the end of this post, you should have a better understanding of how to communicate effectively and confidently in both spoken and written form. The importance of communication skills. Good communication skills are important in all aspects of life. In the workplace, effective communication can help you to get ahead and be more successful. Strong communication skills can also help you to build better relationships, resolve conflict, and achieve your personal and professional goals. There are many benefits of having strong communication skills. When you are able to communicate effectively, you will be better able to get your point across clearly, persuade and influence others, build rapport and relationships. Resolve conflicts. Communicate assertively. Understand others better. Be more successful in the workplace. The basics of communication. Verbal and written. Effective communication involves both verbal and written skills. Verbal skills involve the ability to speak clearly and confidently, while written skills involve the ability to write clearly and concisely. In order to communicate effectively, you need to be able to do both. Here are some tips for improving your communication skills. Verbal communication tips. Make eye contact when speaking to others. Listen carefully and actively. Repeat back what you have heard to ensure understanding. Ask questions if you are unsure of something. Speak slowly and clearly. Use simple language that can be easily understood. Avoid using jargon or technical terms unless you are sure the person you are speaking to will understand them. Written communication tips. Write in a clear and concise manner. Organize your thoughts before writing. Use short sentences and paragraphs for clarity. Edit and proofread your work before sending it out or publishing it. Verbal communication tips. Eye contact is one of the most important aspects of verbal communication. It helps to build rapport, trust, and understanding between people. When you make eye contact with someone, it shows that you are interested in what they have to say and that you are paying attention to them. There are a few things to keep in mind when making eye contact. Try to maintain eye contact for 50 to 60% of the time when speaking with someone. This shows that you are engaged in the conversation and interested in what they have to say. When listening, make sure to give the person your full attention by making eye contact with them. This lets them know that you value what they are saying and are taking it in. Avoid looking around the room or at other people while speaking or listening. This can make the person feel like you are not really interested in them or the conversation. Listening skills. Listening is a key part of communication, but it is often underrated. Just because you are hearing what someone is saying does not mean that you are actually listening to them. 
Active listening requires engagement and concentration on both the words being said and the nonverbal cues being given off by the speaker. Some tips for active listening include Maintain eye contact with the speaker. Avoid distractions such as your phone, computer, or other people in the room. Don't interrupt the speaker. Wait until they have finished before responding. Repeat back what you heard to ensure that you understood correctly. Ask questions if clarification is needed. Speaking with confidence. One way to come across as more confident when speaking is to slow down your rate of speech and take pauses between sentences instead of rushing through your words. This will help you to enunciate clearly and project confidence even if you don't feel 100% sure of yourself. Another tip is to use strong body language such as standing up straight, making eye contact, and using gestures. All of these nonverbal cues will help communicate confidence even if your voice might be trembling. Written communication tips. In order to write clearly, it is important to use simple language that can be understood by your audience. When you are writing for a general audience, avoid using jargon or technical terms. Use active voice and concrete nouns to make your writing more understandable. It is also important to organize your thoughts before you start writing, so that your ideas are presented in a logical order. Writing for different audiences. When you are writing for a specific audience, it is important to tailor your message to them. Consider what they need or want to know and adjust your tone and style accordingly. For example, if you are writing an email to your boss, you should use a more formal style than if you were sending a message to a friend. Editing and proofreading. Once you have finished writing, it is important to edit and proofread your work before sending it off. This will help ensure that there are no errors in grammar or spelling and that your ideas are conveyed clearly. To edit effectively, read your work aloud or have someone else read it for you. Proofreading can be done using spell checkers or grammar checkers, but it is also important to read through your work carefully yourself. Conclusion. In conclusion, Communication skills are important for success in both personal and professional life. Good communication involves both speaking and writing clearly, as well as listening attentively and responding appropriately. By following the tips outlined in this blog post, you can improve your communication skills and better manage difficult conversations.